Finally, guys, we got to our type two binary uh, practice sheet. Number one, final problem, problem 16. So we're going to look at it, and we have the name of lead four oxide, and we need to figure out what the formula for lead four oxide is. Okay, so again, we're going to look at lead, and we see that there's a Roman numeral after lead that is four. And so really, that is the charge of lead. Okay, and that's a positive four. We sneak over to the oxygen. So we have oxide. And again, I know what it is, but let's just double check where it's at. So oxygen or oxide right here, it's in 6A, which means it needs to get two, it gains two electrons to get to the next noble gas. If I go back to the monatomic, right there oxygen is, it's a negative two. So let's go back and put a <clears throat> negative two there. Uh, so now we have a two and a four. They do not cancel each other out. So we can do something called the crisscross method. But one thing about this is <clears throat> once we do this, we have to make sure that we reduce to the lowest whole number form. So I'm going to put this two over here and just throw it in right there. And I'm going to put a four right there. So I, I have a two and a four. Um, but... One thing that I have to do is reduce to the lowest number. So this we're going to change this one to a 1 and change this one to a 2. So we reduce to the lowest possible form. What did that really do? Well, if I do my charges, I said plus 4 times 1 is plus 4. A negative 2 times 2 is a negative 4. So my total overall charges cancel each other out at 4 and 4. But now we have our reduced numbers that we have. So we have one lead, and the symbol for lead, and we're gonna find it right here on our periodic table, is right here, it's PB. So we'll go back to uh, our thing here, and so we're gonna have lead, and we're gonna put PB. We only need one, and so we don't put a subscript with that. Then we're gonna do oxygen. I think all of us by now <coughs> probably know the symbol for oxygen, which is O, and we have two of those. But we need to make that a subscript, so we're going to go control uh, less than, and that will give us what we have here in Google Docs. So our formula for lead for oxide is PbO2. That's it. We did we did all of practice uh, sheet number one. Uh, so hopefully it helped you out, and hopefully you can understand how to do more. And maybe you might not need all the help uh, that we gave you here when you do practice sheet number two.